of my people stand the cast of Riverdale. Personally love the daddy jokes. It's a great time. I too ask myself, who is daddy? <laughs> Sounds so weird coming out of my mouth. I decided to do a little tiny holiday giveaway this time. So I bought this on Black Friday and I decided I would give it away to you guys. Here you go, it's right there for all of my people. I laugh so much in my own show. <laughs> to be entered to win the giveaway, all you have to do is follow on Instagram, at Page. That's it. Also, if you follow my trash, yes, my, my trash, it's an extra entry. And I will be DMing the winner on Instagram. We get to laugh at me failing and how I don't look as cute as they do. Self-deprecation. Step one to a Jesse Page video. Step two, talking about something super relevant to the actual video itself. Oh, that's what we're doing right now. And step three, to mention your hair at some point. I just got my hair redone. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I did not get to do Casey Cott as well as other members of the cast. So if you want to see a part two, I will 100% do a part two if this gets 40,000 likes. And also if you've been appreciating these holiday giveaways, let's just pray that I make it back in AdSense. YouTuber. Comment any TV shows I should watch in the future. If you're not subscribed to my channel, hi, I'm Jessie Page and I like to make videos about mental health and identity, but I also like to make just fun videos like this as well because I think mental health is beyond just talking about social anxiety growing up and dealing with being shy in school. I think it's also just about having a good time and enjoying life and showing other people that I can still be happy and positive even when my brain tells me not to. Wow, that got really deep. Let's get started. We Subscribe. <laughs> I saw this photo and it looked like it was taken at Runyon Canyon, which is like a very well-known place to hike. It happens to be relatively close to where I live. So I decided I would replicate her selfie there. Here is some inspiration for you guys. Just to look like Lily Reinhardt, the queen, I literally hiked <laughs> Runyon in heels for my people. I would like to thank not only my dogs, but my lord and savior, Harry Styles. Why? I just think we should always appreciate him. We're going to Runyon and we are going to be doing a Cole photo and a Lily photo. I'm so excited. These are actually really good photos. Let's go to the first little part where there's like a looking point because I think yeah. that's where she is. It could look like it yeah. but without us actually having to hike. Yeah, I'm not hiking. And these, no. These are like low-key mom jeans. <laughs> there definitely are some you, memes. You <laughs> what? Why are you so zoomed in? <laughs> okay, we're good now. Look at this outfit. We're actually going up Runyon right now. <laughs> uh, oh boy. This looks so accurate. How did she get her arms that long? It's like one part of her hair is back. Okay, you tell me. I could do it from that angle. Heck yeah, that's me. Not looking as great as she does, but I try. <laughs> Woo! Did not look as good. It's okay. Again, look like the off-brand Hot Topic version as I do with every one of these videos. I wanted to continue to replicate more of the girls' photos. I literally went to Forever 21 and I bought an orange sweatshirt that was very similar to Melody and I found some graffiti looking art. I am very like smiley in my Instagram pictures. I'm just like, I don't know. I can't pull off that like cool serious look. I look like a puppy that got kicked. So <laughs> essentially I tried it and I did not look as great as she did. And then I also went to a restaurant, flat out told them, I was like, hey, I'm replicating this photo. Can you get a cup that looks like this? And took a photo that looked a lot like Cammie's. She posted a black and white, had like an old fashioned style, like stylistic approach that made me sound professional. Let's keep that in Jesse. And uh, I um, recreated that as well. And a lot of that was done in like post. I just used my regular iPhone camera and I blurred the background to make it look a bit more like a professional photo, though. If you're an actual professional, you know it's not a professional photo. So for KJ, I had so many photos I wanted to recreate. He plays electric guitar too, and I just think it's so cool. Ugh. I happen to appreciate people even more when they play electric guitar. I just feel like we're connected by the soul, even though he has no idea I exist. I play electric guitar too. <laughs> Maybe I'll insert a cool electric guitar solo to make me seem cooler than I am. <laughs> Don't sleep on my guitar playing, guys. <laughs> Anyways, we created one of his photos. So I'm wearing a Riverdale shirt from an online store called Benny and Veronica. And then I'm wearing a tennis skirt. Classic. 
So it's like it's fighting. Yeah. For Cole, I had multiple photos I wanted to recreate. This is one that was on Casey's Instagram. I wanted to recreate one of Casey's, but this one seemed the easiest on his Instagram and it was Cole. So it looked like they were out to, to fancy brunch or something. So I literally went to a restaurant and I ordered something that looked exactly like his. All right, we just got the shirt. We couldn't find a tank top, but this will work. We're currently trying to replicate the brunch looking photo and they have pictures of the food. We're literally gonna try to get food that looks like his. So much, I love it. He could have gotten like a sandwich like that and taken all the stuff out. We need to get toast. Done. This is what we're doing. This is so much, I love it. Wow, we did my eyebrows great today. Thought you should know. The first thing we have to do is line the food up right. <laughs> So much effort is being put into this to make it look just like how he ate it. This is amazing. Put this up in the register so we could film. The hands are like this. Yeah, like that, and then your hand is down, you're looking at your phone. We got this. You look proud. So, we just finished that one. We conquered it. We did that in 25 minutes. It looks nearly as good. Again, one of these days, if I were a Pokemon, my weakness would be self-deprecation and insecurity. <laughs> Jesse Page use self-deprecation. This photo is a lot older. It's freaking hilarious. He's at a pharmacy and he's holding a manual breast pump. I appreciate it. It's my humor. <laughs> we're about to recreate this photo. We just need, what was it, a breast pump? Yeah. Breast milk pump. <laughs> I didn't know those existed. <laughs> Baby care. Baby care, nursing pads. It's the same one. High five. <laughs> Wait, I'm so excited. I'm such a loser. I'm in the middle of CBS getting excited that I found the same manual breast pump as Girls Brown. <laughs> Where do we take this photo? Let's try and find like a blue thing. I saw it. This is fun. This is something I would do. <laughs> Dressed as Cole, I feel really cool. <laughs> I see why he wears this jacket. I feel like right here is good. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Sorry, okay. And more in front of the box. Yeah, let's do it closer. More me. I can't wink. <laughs> Perfect. This reminds me of something my brother and I would laugh at for an hour. All we do is send each other Pokemon memes. <laughs> And then I took one more photo. In editing, attempted to make this one look similar. This one was incredibly difficult because I was trying to do it via portrait mode and portrait mode, as a lot of you might know, the effect is less obvious the closer you are to the subject. I was the subject, that's me. What are you doing? Da -da -da -da. Ooh, does the sun make me look cool? I feel cool. Yeah. I can't button it. Someone else's shirt, they left it at my place for like a year. I literally look like a little girl that like got her ice cream cone dropped though. Like he looks fierce. I literally just look like... <laughs> Wait, show how crazy I look right now in this mountain. I mean, a look, a daddy. <laughs> and then like I put a happy laugh after but like I'm miserable <laughs> so <laughs> as for posting the photos I posted most of the photos to my at Jesse trash and after this video I'm gonna post the remaining ones to my at Jesse page Instagram why because I'm scared of rejection and people are nicer on my trash <laughs> the first photo I posted was the cami one and I guess to look at likes and stuff this is actually one of my most liked pictures on Instagram Cool fact. I was cautious to post it because I've never posted a black and white photo just because my blue hair is such a part of, I guess, my general aesthetic and so on. So I was like, I mean, I have freaking blue hair. Why would I make my pictures black and white? But you guys liked it. Thank you. <laughs> a lot of you 100% did notice this looked like Cami Mendez. Mermaid hair Jesse said Cami Mendez. It wasn't the overwhelming majority of people noticed, but yeah, <laughs> a lot of you guys did notice. When I posted the Cole photos, a lot of people were also commenting as well, but not as many people 100% figured it out, as well as the KJ one. I think it's just because I look very different. However, the manual breast pump one was kind of obvious because, you know, the Madeline one, a lot of people realized just because she's like a very particular editing style with the white borders and so on. So I posted all the photos and a lot of people were speculating by the end. That's typically what happens with these, but I think a lot more people noticed with this than when I did this video with YouTubers, which is so interesting because you think more of the people that watch my videos would recognize that I was copying YouTubers Instagrams versus Riverdale 
All right. <laughs> and I guess you guys are all trash for Riverdale. I mean, same. I think part of why I watch Riverdale is because their lives and their love lives are just constantly going and they just live vicariously. They have more interesting lives than I do and I'm just like, wow, attractive people, you go. Live your life that's more interesting than mine. <laughs> so as for growing on Instagram, I did have more impressions than last week as well. Wow. I've been killing it. <laughs> so impressions essentially equates to how many people view your photo and it shows all of the photos posted in the past year sorted by the amount of impressions and right behind the first photo I posted with blue hair is actually the one of Cami Mendez. Cool. What I learned from this don't be scared to post in black and white, Jesse. It's really cool to see how different people's Instagrams reflect their personalities and their lifestyles, and they're all hotter than I am. And scene. If any of them want to date me. <laughs> kidding. Cool. Well, I'm gonna feature my amazing people, your amazing Instagram and Twitter posts, and your pages. I appreciate you all. Be sure to follow on Instagram, at Jessie Page, at Jessie Trash. I said that so casually, at Jessie Trash. For more great meme content, and also to be entered to win the giveaway. Also, my Twitter is cool too. I'm just gonna throw in more self promo while I'm feeling awkward here, while I look cute. It's uh, at Jessie Page, if you wanna follow that too. Okay, cool. Ooh, that felt